Hello and welcome. This is Mouse Gunner, and we're back with some more Motorsport Manager returning to the Predator Racing Group and the Worst Best Challenge. And it's the beginning of the fifth season. We're coming up on the first race of that season. And although we are ranked 10th overall for car performance, and I'm not sure how well we'll do this season, it is still early, and hopefully we can get points just due to the unreliability of cars early in the season. In any case, the upcoming uh, race that we have. It looks like we have projected stormy weather, which is going to make things more challenging, but might also give us a chance to get the points uh, for this race. Top speed is crucial, as well as acceleration and high-speed corners, but top speed is the part that's not a spec part here, so this is where we're really going to see a divergence with the different teams. We have a low fuel burn and very high tire wear, and then we have super softs and softs for our tire choices. All right, with that being said, let's go ahead and continue on to the race. I'm going to go ahead and choose my sponsorship bonus. I'm going to go with 16th or above because I think that's the safe bet. And we already did the part fitting earlier, so I'm going to go ahead and move on. Now, because we are 10th overall in our car performance, I don't think I'm going to take the practice. I'm going to go ahead and simulate it just because I think it will save us time. If this is going to be another development year where we're far behind, I'd rather get through the season quickly and try and develop the cars rather than waste a lot of time in a practice for a race that we probably don't have that much of a chance in. But this early in the season, it might matter a little bit more, but still, nonetheless, I'm going to go ahead and simulate. And it looks like we have higher downforce here with Lawton's car. So I'm just going to move that over a little bit. Also looks like we need a slightly stiffer suspension, but eh, it's kind of hard to say right now. And then maybe slightly longer gearing, but I'm not going to mess with that too much either. As far as the tire compound, softs are okay. As much as it's sunny weather now, we might have a lot of rain for the race. And then over here, we need lower downforce. So maybe something like that. We need slightly stiffer suspension, but we need to go more towards acceleration here. So I think that's probably going to be a good setup to start. And again, softs, that's fine. Go ahead and confirm. Where the Let the AI do the practice. All right, and our result, we get 15th and 20th overall in the practice. And we'll see what kind of bonuses the AI manages to give us. But we do have our mechanic bonus, which is going to be the main one that we want to take advantage of. Uh, I'm not sure how we got as far as the luck of the draw on the pole positions. We'll have to see there, too. Uh, so we did get a race trim and super soft tire bonus, but I'm going to be using the race trim and the nurse ability. And then over here, race trim and the risk taker so we can do quicker pits without risk. And then we're pretty dialed in with Lawton's car. Not so much with Santana's. That's unfortunate. What's the weather looking like to start off? So it looks like a little bit of rain to start. And we have intermediates already selected. I didn't take a look, though, to make sure we were full on fuel, which we are. So we're, we're good there. Um, so it's complaining about the tire selection. Let's just take a look at the grid and see what the rest of the people are doing. Oh, we got lucky here with the first pole position because the first race of the season is going to be randomized because it is based off of your driver standings, but we haven't established that. So where you start is pretty much random. Santana, not so lucky, middle of the pack, 12th. But yeah, the pack's all running intermediate, so us running intermediates is not a disadvantage. There's only a little bit of water on the track, which is why it's complaining, but it will build. And then it looks like it's going to get sunny for a while, so I don't know if that stormy weather is going to happen or when it's going to happen. I'm assuming it will happen at some point, but it might be very late in the race, and we might be running dry tires most of the time. So that's interesting. All right, let's go ahead and get onto the race here. Oh, I didn't uh, do a strategy. I'll have to do that really quickly here. Uh, I'm going to assume with the, the weather the way it is, we're going to want to start pushing the tires. So I'm just going to really quickly do that. Let's switch over to uh, Lawtonin. And then let's start the race. All right, hopefully we get a good start here and can pull out a lead or we'll just get immediately <laughs> passed by a couple cars. That's no good either. 
All right, so we're in third, down to fourth, and quickly losing places here. I'm not happy to see that. And Santana is also quickly losing places. So 17th for Santana, eighth for Lottinen. Hopefully she can hold out a little bit better here, not so much, ninth. But she has a little bit of a gap behind her, so hopefully at this point we'll be okay. Another thing, we're probably going to want to abuse these tires just because uh, the water's eventually going to go away, the rain that is. Alright, so we're holding out a little bit better here in 9th. Santana not so well in 19th. Ooh, something must have happened here, maybe body contact as we get up into 7th here. But we do have this guy behind us breathing down our neck. And Santana is in 19th, but I assume she will pass the people with the body damage. All right, now Lottenen's down into 8th, but she has a gap behind her, so hopefully we can maintain. How's the weather looking? All right, we're starting to have that dry period. I still do not see the stormy weather, so I don't know when that's going to happen. We're going to have to keep a close eye on the water to determine when we need to come in. Tire life is looking okay. Tire temps still cool, so I'm going to assume that's going to be kind of the trend for this track, although temperatures uh, are coming up. So we're in 8th and 17th at this point. All right, where are we on the weather? We're still good. Nobody's pitting yet, so we'll just go around another time here. We might have enough separation, and with Lawton being able to do the quicker pits, we could probably pit both of our cars at the same time. Okay, we're starting to dry off. We don't have any pitting happening yet. Oh, no, there we go. So the car that's currently in second did not pit. Let us abuse the tires while we got them, because we know we're going to be uh, changing these. And then let's cue our pits. So first, let's pit with Lawton in. And it's going to be dry. With the way that this track is and how high the tire wear is, I'm not sure what the better strategy is. To use super softs or softs. I kind of like the strategy of taking on fuel that doesn't cost you time. And it's a lot easier to do that if you're changing your tires frequently. And also having the faster tires is going to give you faster laps. I think I'm going to go with the super softs because we're still not seeing any stormy weather on the forecast. So we're probably going to have at least another pit, if not more, before that comes in. All right, so we've got the, su the super softs. We're going to fuel up in a way that doesn't cost us time. As a matter of fact, that didn't cost us time at all. And as far as pitch strategy, we can go ahead and do the fast and get a four-second pit. So we'll do go ahead and cue that. And then over here, I think I might want to even do the same strategy. So I'm going to go with super softs. We're going to fuel up until it costs us time, which is about there. We're not going to take a risk pit, though. We're going to do that one. And it looks like we're good. So let's pit. I'm going to have to keep an eye on the condition of our parts as well. Okay, uh... As soon as uh, Lightning gets into the pits, I'm going to have to tell her to back off on her strategy. And then Santa Ana, the same. And then we'll switch back to Lightning. So Lightning is currently in ninth. If she gets out fast enough, we might get out here in the same position. So we're good. And it looks like Santa Ana comes out in 14th. So she improved her position quite a bit. So we're in ninth. Oh, we got a safety car. That's unfortunate. Who crashed? Okay. Nobody's going to give us positions. And we're kind of stuck with where we are. So I'm just going to tell everybody, turn everything down, save us fuel and everything. Although the tire temps are probably going to be looking pretty low. Now, other people are pinned here. Unfortunately, we're too far away to really gain an advantage from that. 
So if anything, we might be at a disadvantage with the way things went. But we are 9th and 12th. This is going to give us a chance to maybe catch up if, if anybody ever does get behind a safety car here. Tire temps are looking low. I may have to go up to a higher strategy here to try and prevent them from getting too cool. All right, now we're caught up. I don't know how much this benefits me though. To be honest. And we are currently out of points. All right, I feel like we gotta start heating up these tires because they're way too cool. All right, this is gonna be where we start going. So let's medium. Medium and let's start pushing these tires so we can get them up in temperature as a matter of fact I might even start attacking although. I don't know if I really like that Because we're gonna need to get this these temps up quickly Okay, Lawton manages to keep her place and Santana is really fighting here Okay, um I'm gonna back off here a little bit because we've got a little bit of temp in these tires I don't want to shred them too badly. I am going to tell London to let Santana through if there is ever a chance for it. Because uh, Santana is actually starting to catch up here. Alright. So, Santana and Lawton are right with each other. And then London's going to let Santana through. So, we're 10th and 11th at this point. Ordinarily, I'd be very happy with this position, but this gives us absolutely no points, so I'm not too excited. On, uh, I'm not sure how excited I can be for that. We're going to back off on the tire pushing because we are more neutral in our attempts now. I am going to try and push the tires a little bit more here. So Santana is having to fight a guy in 11th. Now she has a penalty when she has somebody close like this and there's nobody else around. So her stats are going to be affected by this guy. And I have a feeling actually his teammate coming up is actually going to help us a little bit. Because now she has two cars near her. So she's going to get her stats back. But she is very barely holding this guy off, and I don't think it's going to last long. Okay, so Lawton is definitely going to need to pit here. And we'll switch over. Where is our weather looking like? Okay, so that's unfortunate. I'm going to have to pit. There's no way around it, but we're going to have that weather coming in very soon. So we're going to have to do this. Take on fuel until we uh, are good on time. Fast it. I actually would have liked to have pitted this lap. As a matter of fact, Santana, I think I'm going to have you pit now. Although I'm kind of hating this. All right. I hate this a lot because our, our two cars are really close to each other, but I feel like we got to go for it. And we're going to push here just to use up these tires. And everybody else is coming off too, so it's not that big of a deal. The car right behind me is coming off, so if we have a nice quick pit here, we'll be okay. The only problem is I don't think Santana is going to get out fast enough for Lawton in. And then we're going to continue to push these tires because we're going to have to use these up. As a matter of fact, I'm just going to go straight to attack here. I'm going to use these tires up pretty aggressively. And then when the rain comes in, we'll pit again. Now the one thing is that these guys that are pitting right now, they're going to have the tires even less time than we have them, so... So we're in 8th and 10th. 
We're in points right now. All right. It's going to be coming any time now. Now, the tricky thing is the water is going to build up. So we're going to need intermediates. All right, we can back off a little bit here. Ah, screw it. I'm curious what the car in 16th is doing right now. This is kind of that period of time where it's like I want to pit, but I'm not sure. Because it's going to start any second now. What I think I'm going to do is maybe have Lawton in early pit. Because the rain should be coming like any second now. The only thing is, our pits are so much quicker now that you can't, you can't really allow for too much time. We might be okay going around another time. So... I think I'm going to do it. In any case, nobody else pitted, so it's not that big of a deal. But we should have rain coming in right now. And yeah, there it is. Okay, and there's complaints about the suspension, so we're probably going to have to fix some parts here. All right, so Santa Ana, we're going to need you to pit. And you're going to pit for... Inners to start. Because it's not wet enough for wet. We're going to abuse the crap out of those tires. And we're not taking any more time. Car condition, we're fine. So you can just do a normal pit here. Okay. Now, lotting in, we need to fix some parts. So let's go ahead and pit. We're going to take on intermediates. We're going to uh, first do park condition. So we're going to fix this part. That adds on 11 seconds. And then we can fuel up. And it shouldn't cost us any more time. So we get full fuel out of that. And do a fast pit. And then uh, while you're at it, go ahead and overtake. Uh, do we want to do that, though? Because that's going to close up the gap, and then they're going to have to wait. Uh, fine, just do a high gear. Oh, wrong car. How about this? There we go. All right, so let's switch back over to Lawton. Other cars are coming in into pit. Oh, they took wets. Oh, no. All right, well, we'll still work it. Um, go into attack, please. And you know what? You can even go into high gear, too. Because uh, you're just going to get more fuel here in a second. And then you go into attack. Go. We should be much faster than the guys on wet tires right now. And then once it gets wet enough, we'll switch. As a matter of fact, go into overtake. Go into overtake. Give me as much speed as you can. All right, you back off a little bit because I'm a little bit concerned about your engine, actually, now that I think about it. So we're in fifth and eighth. Okay, um... We might want to back it off a little bit just because of the the downpour. I don't want to get crashed here. So again, we're going to be faster than a lot of these guys that are on wet tires. Now, not everybody took wet tires, so there's that too. We're into third. This is amazing. Still not wet enough to pit yet. All right, we might be able to get away with a pit for Lawton in, taking wets. Yep, 
Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. So Lawton in pit, you're in fourth, which is amazing. Uh, take on wet. Go ahead and fuel... Hmm. Car condition. This is where I'm a little bit concerned. I feel like we're going to have to fix some parts here. So fix, fix. This is going to add a lot of time, obviously, and maybe cost her dearly. And then I feel like you might as well take on fuel if it's going to allow you to. And then should be good there, pit. And why don't you go back into an overtake roll? And then Santa Ana, stick with it. And at this point, you're going to pit too. You're going to take on wets. Okay, we don't even want any more time. Balanced. Giving you wets. We're good there. Fuel option. Fueled up. That should be enough fuel to get around. And parts. I'm hoping with the parts we have, we're good. And I'm going to back off here. Okay. We could probably even keep her in uh, overtake, but I'm going to switch to neutral. Alright, so she's in fifth. Losing a lot of places now. Because she's repairing. Almost forgot that we were doing that. Okay. Santana out a little bit longer than she needed to be. But that's okay. We're pinning now. We're going to lose one place. But that's it. So we're out in fourth. And you can go back to a neutral stance. And I guess you can go into high gear here. Because we do have extra fuel. Why don't you go into push as well. Get some temp in those tires. So we're in fourth. We got the guy in fifth on our butt. That's unfortunate. All right, we just had somebody retire up in front of us, so we're going to get up back up into fourth, but we're going to maybe lose here fifth. Going to full overtake here. Try and keep this guy off us. I don't think we're going to succeed, though, so... We're down to fifth, but we shouldn't lose any more places than that, I'm hoping. As a matter of fact, let's go to that strategy there. Lawton is uh, really cooking it. And should catch the guy in ninth. Well, we're in points. I would like to get Lawton into a point position as well. Okay. We only have a few laps to go. We might be able to go into full overtake now. And maybe catch one of these guys. Alright, so Lawton and just passed. Into ninth. Quite a lot of gap, though, to get to eighth. We've got fourth and third ahead of us. Passed fourth easily. Just got into eighth with uh, Lawton and now into seventh. Alright, we might want to back off here because our engine's starting to hate us. Okay, Lawton has a chance at six here, and it looks like she easily gets it. Okay, we're in second at this point. And fifth. We might even get first here. Well, I am so glad I took the conservative sponsorship because holy crap, we could have gotten a lot of money. This is where I wish the sponsorships were not optional. I wish that it was just, if you got second or above, you get this. 
All right, so we're on the last lap. I don't think we're going to catch the guy in first, but we're trying. Lonnen is in fourth. Let's switch to her. I don't think she's going to catch the guy in third, but amazing finish. Her tires are close to dying on her, but that's what you got to do to win a race. All right. Well, that couldn't have gone any better, honestly. We got second and fourth. Amazing. That was even with Lawton and fixing three of her parts during the race, she managed to get into fourth. And that was a lot of that was just fueling up the car and being able to take advantage of the fuel that we got. All right. Well, that went pretty darn well. And let us continue. Now, we didn't break any rules, and I don't suspect anyone else uh, has either. So let's go ahead and continue here. All right. So Santana's in second. Lawton in fourth. We're going to get a lot of points here. So eight points for Santa Ana. And another five for Lawton. So that's going to give us a total of 13 points. Let's see where... Oh, that puts us first overall. Now, I do not think we will keep this position. But I think with this first race, we have scored more points than we scored all of last season. <laughs> all right. Well, in any case, let's go ahead and continue here. I don't think we'll see a repeat of that performance this season, but, you know, you never know. Hopefully we can improve the cars, and, and with the way things go this early in the season, with the cars not being uh, reliable at times, maybe we can get things going. All right, well, that went amazingly. Uh, we came in first, although that didn't improve our marketability as, as much as you would think when we're predicted to finish 10th, and you get into first, come on. All right, well... It's still an improvement. And again, if I had uh, taken the more risky sponsorships, we would have been getting a lot of cash that race, but there's no way I could predict that kind of finish. But let's, let's take a look at that sponsorship and dream what we could have had, right? So if we had finished second or above, we could have had $880,000 on top of that winnings that we got or the earnings we got for that weekend. Well, in any case, I think this is a good point to go ahead and put a cut in the video. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. This is Mouse Gunner, signing out.